In terms of a challenge and an adventure, you know, Dakar is life changing. It doesn't matter whether you're a mechanic, whether you're a driver, whether you're someone watching it. You know, we crossed the Andes twice in previous years, 4,700 meters. You're driving over the Andes, beautiful blue lakes, llamas sitting on the side of the road. It's an amazing experience. The 2014 Dakar Rally route stretches over more than 9,000 kilometers with 13 special stages accounting for some 5,500 kilometers of that total. The teams can expect massive support from huge spectator crowds along the route. Dakar uh, comes to South America. Uh, the people love rally, love uh, 4x4. It's completely different for sure. The, in Africa, for me, it was the spirit of the race, of the Dakar. It was really adventure, it was longer, more harder also. Nowadays this race is, it's, it's, it's a sprint race, it's not an endurance race anymore. It's flat out from the word go. You know, it's easy to maintain that pace over two or three days, but to maintain that pace over two weeks is uh, really where the difficulty comes in and uh, it's very tricky. It will be the Ford Racing Ranger's first attempt at the Dakar, but the South African built racing machine has undergone extensive testing and also benefits from a solid and successful racing pedigree. With South Africa's own Chris Fisser piloting one of the two Rangers, local interest will be at an all-time high. South Africa is one of the biggest new entrants on the Dakar Rally and with high-level teams. To have another team, to have another South African driver, just further takes the credibility of the cars, the teams and also the championship.